Hi. Long time no see. I miss you guys so much. And then also uh, very happy to seeing everybody here uh, gathering around and then to have a coffee talk sharing, especially from our greatest, Luigi, Manuela, Carmen, and then uh, all the champions and great baristas. Uh, yeah, back to the story because I, when I first met Luigi was in 2018 in Belo Horizonte, Brazil. Uh, while I'm competing in the World Latiat Championship for my very first time. So it is my first time to win my national champion and then to represent uh, my country to the world stage. So by the time I was actually uh, not really confident about myself, but I did really prepare a lot for my Latiat routines and my patterns. I am not so sure about this competition because it is my first time. So I just want to enjoy and then just uh, wanted to give it uh, all I can give to the competition and to all of the people out there, especially those champions competitors around me. So uh, I did a very good job in the prelim round and then I, I really cannot forget that moment because Luigi comes to me and then he's, he say, congratulations, Irvin. Okay, okay. I say, yeah, thank you so much. Uh, and then he told me that, believe in me, you are the best. But okay, okay. Uh, I'm not too sure, but thank you so much. And then the next day, uh, after I done my semi-final routine. Uh, when I met Luigi again, he told me again that you are the best. Okay, I start to have some confidence, you know, because uh, not really have a lot of people talk with me that time because uh, I looks like a kid. Uh, I'm quiet and then I look small. Um, yeah, not much people know about me and then only Luigi and then a few of the baristas that I know will talk to me. So I really respect a lot from the humble and then for the, for the nice words to me because it really helps me a lot to build my confidence in the competition. And then uh, the next year, I was invited by Luigi and then Musetti to the CJEP in Rimini, right? To have some sharing and then have some uh, latte art show uh, during the events. And then that time, I remember it was actually the competition time for Carmen and Manuela in the Italy National. So before, before I go to Italy, I was thinking about uh, who is going to be the Italy champion this year. And then I really, really uh, looking forward to see Manuela patterns because last year in Brazil, 2018, she actually did a very good job. Just like what uh, Luigi told us just now, nobody will be like Manuela about the skills. It's only she can do what she can do. The Rosetta is really Mamma Mia. Mamma mia. <laughs> no, no other people can do like this. Okay, so as a European, it is very impressive. I would say it, just only Manuela and now Carmen can do it because the generation is keep going. So when, when I saw the Manuela pattern for the national, Italy national, I was like, this is really good. This is really good. For sure, you will win. For sure, um, for being a barista, deliver a cup of coffee to your customers or maybe to your judge. It's actually about your own personality and your own confidence. If you are confident enough, you will show your personality. Just like if you guys watch Carmen presentation on the stage, you will understand what I mean. And Manuela on the world stage even me on the world stage, we are being ourselves and then we want to show the world about uh, actually 
what we want to show. And then we are confident to push the boundaries. Uh, since 2017, uh, Anon has created the new technique. And then I developed the technique. And then until Manuela, she changed the technique into another style. Uh, in, 2000, in between 2018 and 19, you see a lot of the similar patterns that have my style. But after Manuela, everything changed. Now it has a different way to do the latte art. So I, I mean the generation changing is very important and then things will just keep improve, improve, improve. We don't even know what will happen in these five years for the latte art.